All right, here with Brenna McKenna in her first year in the industry. How, Brenna, tell me the story about why you decided to make the, the jump in the adult from. Um, so I was a stripper and all of the clubs closed down during COVID. So I started traveling to other states to dance. Then I started an OnlyFans. And then I realized I was sucking dick all the time for OnlyFans. And I was really good at it. And then one of my best friends was like, you should do porn and just do it for real and make good money and not, you know, be traveling all over the place. Mm -hmm. but you're still <laughs> sucking dancing. random dick, so. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm here. Right, but you're still dancing as well, right? I do, I do dance when I'm home. Yeah, I, and I feature dance now. How have you liked it so far? Were there nerves at first? Have you eased right in? Kind of describe that. Nerves. Like nerves, like in the best way. Um, and I get nervous every single time because I love it. It's like I played sports and I would get nervous almost every game because you want to do well no matter what. And that's how I feel when I walk on set. Like I feel like I just like get butterflies and need to go to the bathroom. And then, you know, like every single time. And then it always turns out great. What are the type of scenes where you feel like you really flourish? When, you're, when you feel like you're at your best? Uh, gonzo anal scenes. It's, it's what I do the most now since I do anal, but they are also like so fun. You go with the flow, and then if you have chemistry, it's like really, really good. But yeah, like just going straight through and looking hot and sexy and just doing what you do best and just like being your actual self is like so fun and freeing. Last thing, as is a, is a newcomer, are there, are there veterans in the industry that you're, you're starting to look up to and admire or someone that's become a mentor? Yeah. Um, I admire people that I follow on Twitter, like I see how they engage with their fans and I see how they just choose who to um, to work with. So yeah, there's a few people, a lot of men actually, I look up to a lot of guys in the industry um, and I and I found a few people that I can really trust, so yeah. yeah. Well, best of luck in 2023, thanks for taking some time. Thank you. <laughs>